and welcome to Prayers That Light Our Path this afternoon. I apologize for posting this this afternoon rather than this morning, but it just seemed like this morning I just couldn't get everything together and to get it done the way I would like to get it done. You know, as I was going through the day, I, I <clears throat> was reminded there's a lot of a lot of difficulty in our world. There's a lot of adversary in our world. There's a lot of sickness in our world. There's a lot of evil in our world. And you know, sometimes when you sit back and you allow yourself to think about those things, you you begin sometimes to maybe have some doubts about your faith. All of us do. It's, it's not hard to let the circumstances of life sometimes get us down. But I think what, it is, what is important is to remember that no matter what the issues are, if we will continue to have faith and we will continue to put our trust in God, then He will walk with us through all the things of life that are unpleasant. I, it I reminded me of a verse. You know, sometimes we even allow things to get to the point that we want to maybe doubt. Maybe we think, well, going to church ain't helping me, so I'm going to just skip out today. Or, you know, this thing about having faith, man, it, I don't know, it, it ain't seeming to work. And maybe we allow ourselves sometimes to backslide just a little bit. But there's a verse in Hosea, chapter 14, verse 4, and this is what that verse tells us. I will heal their backsliding. I will love them freely, for mine anger is turned away from him. Y'all, what a wonderful blessing that is, that even on those periods of time when we do doubt, when we do allow ourselves to backslide a little, that God is still there. God is going to love us, irregardless. That His, His anger is not going to be toward us. We just can't allow our anger to be toward Him. God loves you. Go with me in prayer. Father, even though I've... We, we sometimes slide away from our faith. We thank you that we can hold on, that we can hang on to this promise that you give us, which says you still love me. All I need to do is to turn to you again in forgiveness. Forgive us, Father. Forgive us for our double-mindedness at times. Part of us wants to always believe in you, but fear and doubt have drawn us away from your love at times. We don't want to doubt or, or to destroy our love for you. Heal, heal us from the things that would separate us. Yours is a wonderful love, Father, that does not count our wrongdoings. Help us to live in that love every day. Father, thank you for that love. Thank you for the promises. And in your name this afternoon we pray. Amen. My friends, when times get rough, the old saying is the tough have to get going. Our times are rough. There's a lot of sickness. There's a lot of fear. There's a lot of evil in our world. Don't let that draw you from God's love. Remember, God loves you no matter what. I love you, and the people of the United Methodist Church love you. And I hope you have a wonderful afternoon.